Frankfurt, Germany. I always get ready first and they always take forever. Look at that. Akila is still in the room. Bad news there. I'm here ready to go. Come on, let's go. Is this the book of everyone? It's, it's my condolence book. When I died, I put this in the church. On Tuesday, I do two sessions. And then why did you go professional? Why did I start with that? Yeah, yeah. Well, well, I started well. jujitsu because I wanted to fight MMA, and I did. I fought, um, I fought in UFC. Yep. I fought in many organizations, big organizations. Uh, the, the goal of jiu-jitsu was to become good at fighting, not to be good at jiu-jitsu. Uh, via leg locks, and leg locks are good, but they've become easy to do, and some people are easy to do them too. And what happens is people become really good at them and they just leg lock over and over again, the easy people. And then when they can't do it to the hard people, they try something else. And in reality, it should be the other way around. When you get an easy person, you shouldn't leg lock them. You should do something that's harder for you to do, but it's not impossible to do against the easy person. And then you should practice the leg lock on the guy that's really hard, because that's the guy who's going to make your position all better. <laughs> Just finished the last session here in uh, Germany with my friend Boris at uh, his gym here in uh, near Frankfurt. Uh, great seminar today. We did some sweeping, wrestling up drills. About to hit the sauna here, get my recovery in because the last this last couple weeks have been hard. This trip's been training every single day, which I normally don't do because I'm trying to respect my body, but I have to do what I got to do on the strips and. Uh, I get these opportunities to do some uh, recovery. I'm, I'm running for it. So I'm headed to the sauna. I would bring you in the camera in the sauna, but there's a lot of naked men in there. So that's not happening. Nope. So it's a tradition here in Germany. <laughs> Everybody after training, they drink beer. Um, the professor here has a fridge stuck with a non-alcoholic beer. So after training, they all drink that for like hydration. Hello. 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 Achilles. You met Boris? Achilles, nice name, poor fighter. <laughs> Acho que todo brasileiro gosta disso. Arroz. Tem o português. Hã? E tem o português também. Todo adora. português gosta Português também adora. Arroz, feijão e ovo. E ovo. Arroz branquinho solto. Um feijão preto. No mesmo uma feijoadazinha. Hum. Com ovo frito em cima. Delícia. 
Tá doido. Dá água na boca, eu acabei de comer. Estamos num restaurante peru peruano. A comida tava uma delícia. Comemos um, um bife sol bife soltado. Saltado. 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 So good. So, we're in Germany, rolling with the roaches. Uh, we're talking jujitsu. What's what's on the play, Jazz? We're, what's next? We're talking uh, Miami Open tomorrow morning. I'm going to be fighting in the Black Belt Open class, and then the two weekends after that, I'll be fighting in the Denver Open, ADCC Open. Let's go. Let's go. Did you just see him take a lot, Woody? <laughs> All right, vloggers, we are inside our room in Germany. Last day here, we're packing. It's a whole mess. Achilles here with us. He had his own room, but... And I thought I had a pipe last night. Yeah, but um, yeah, so we're right here. Packing, ready to leave. Next destination will be Casablanca, Morocco. Um, should be fun. Almost done there. Um, almost pack. done. The trip pack. is almost done. Yeah. Like, we got seven more days. Seven, a week and then we'll be home, guys. Ow. Oh, I didn't even notice. What continent are we? Welcome to Africa. 